Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. I'm Asa and I have another one day build to share. This is my drill press, I absolutely adore it. I use it all the time and you've seen it featured in many of my videos. I bought it used off Facebook Marketplace for around $175. Side note, if you don't already use websites like Facebook Marketplace or Craigslist to shop for used tools, I highly recommend it. You can get some incredible deals if you're willing to wait until the tool you want or need is listed. Back to this drill press. It's great, but there's one issue with it. The on-off switch for the motor spindle is right next to the on-off switch for the light. On a couple of occasions now, I've inadvertently turned on the motor spindle when I meant to turn the light on. I'm really worried it's just a matter of time until I hurt myself. I haven't been able to train myself to double and triple check that I'm hitting the right switch, so I'll make a simple cover to prevent myself from turning the wrong thing on. There's lots of off-the-shelf interlock solutions for this type of problem, but I think for an hour of my time and a few cents of 3D printer filament, I can do this myself. This is one of the reasons I love 3D printing. I really like making my own designs and finding other people's to make simple quality of life improvements around the house and around the shop. I so appreciate that the 3D printing community is very open source and gives this stuff away. This little bit holder for my driver is one example. It's excellent, the design was freely available, and I printed it up in something like 20 minutes. The build I'll do today is fairly unique to me and my drill press, but you could follow the same process for your own tools or equipment. It's time to make the design in SolidWorks, print it on my 3D printer, and then assemble it to the drill press. Well, that's it for this build. I think it came out great. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Please like this video if you enjoyed it and consider subscribing to my channel if you want to see more content about building, making, crafting. Thanks again and I'll see you in the next one.